Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. This video is a tutorial on how to add audio per slide in Canva. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add audios to your slides in your presentation or videos that you're creating on Canva. Canva is an amazing platform for creators of all kinds and over here you can make documents, whiteboards, presentations, posts for social media, videos, printable products and even websites. So we're going to look at how to add audios to a video or presentation. So say you've got a presentation to create. So you'll go to presentations and it'll take you to the interface will be like this for creating a presentation of 16 is to 9 size. And these will be the slides like you can keep adding pages or slides over here. Now the same thing applies for videos as well. So say you have created a video on Canva like I have done over here. Now the total duration of this video is 25 seconds as you can see over here and I have added four video clips like this. So let's see now how you can add audios to these slides. There are four slides over here. For this you simply need to go to the left navigation bar over here where you can see you've got all these options from design, elements, brand hub, uploads, text, draw, projects and also apps. If you don't find audio over here, you can simply click on app and then scroll down and you can see audio right over here. So you can click on it and the audio library will open. So you can see there are different genres like happy, pop, epic, piano, instrumental and each one has a lot to choose from. So you can simply click on see all in any category and you can view all of it. Like if I want to add something from the ambient category, then I can just click on see all and you've got all these audios. There are some that are free. There are some that are not available for free. For now, we're going to focus on the ones that are available for free. Now, if you hover your cursor on any of the audios in this pane, then you will see that the play button gets activated and you can click on it to play it and it'll start playing. So you can see that there is a small preview of the audio going on over here. You can see the duration of the audio and the various uh, tones like it's bright, it's peaceful. And if you click on the three dots, you got all these details coming up. So say I want to add this to my first clip. So I'm going to select it and it will get added to my video over here. Now you can see it has gotten added to the whole video, which is not something I want. I want it only for this particular slide, which is a welcome slide. So what you're going to do is basically crop it. Now to crop an audio, you simply need to drag it. Like you can see the cursor changes as I reach the end of the clip and this arrow appears, which simply means you can trim the clip. So I'm going to trim it to exactly the, the length of the first slide, which is 5.7 seconds. And you can see currently it has been adjusted and is in sync with the first slide. Now you say you don't want that particular part of the audio, then what are you going to do? So you are going to select the whole audio like this and trim it to whatever part you want from that particular audio. You will trim on both sides. So say I want this particular part of this particular audio for my first slide. So that's how you trim it and then you place it in sync with your first slide, which is 5.5 seconds. And you can see it has come perfectly with the first slide. Now this is page two or slide number two and you can simply click on the video and you can see uh, this is how it plays. It is currently audio less. So let's go ahead and add another audio from the library here on Canva and this time I'm going to go in with happy. So if I click on see all under this category and I will go through all this and say I want to add this one then you can just go through a preview and if you like what you hear then you can add it. If you click the audio from the pane over there in the left side, it will get added to wherever the cursor is on the timeline in the video. So make sure your cursor is at that particular slide where you want to add the audio. And then again, you can just trim it to whatever part you want of the audio and align it or sync it with the video's length. And currently I've done that for five seconds. So that's how I've added two audios, different audios. And you can see each audio has its own color, like this one's purple, this one's blue. Now for the third slide, now I'm going to show you another way where you can add an audio. Say you want to add a voice over over here. What are you going to do then? First of all, let's make sure that the cursor is at the beginning of the clip. And then you need to go to uploads. And over here, you can see that there is the record yourself. 
So once you click record yourself, your video will appear over here, which you can turn off. And then if you click over here, you've got all these options and you need to make sure that your microphone, the correct one has been selected. And then you will record a timer will appear and then you can record. Say I'm going to record. Welcome to my morning skincare routine. Once the recording is done, click on done and the recording will appear like this. If you click on the play button, you can listen to it. If you don't like it, delete it and re-record for yourself. This is something that will get placed on the video to show that the voiceover is playing. So I'm just going to move it to the, the left bottom corner and click on save and exit. And then you can see that it's getting uploaded over here and as well as it's gotten added over here as well. So now if I click on the play button on this video, there is the audio going on as well on the side. Now for the last slide, again, let's go ahead and add an audio from the uh, audio library over here. And I'm just going to go ahead with this one and it's gotten trimmed itself. Now, when you add an audio, you also have these options here on the top navigation bar. The first one is audio effects. You can add a fade in or fade out. Since this is the end of the video, I'm going to add a fade out and I'm going to just add it for like 0.1 seconds. You can adjust the volume as well. Like if you click on adjust, you can adjust like which part of the audio you want, like which clip from the audio you want. And then if you click on this volume button, you can reduce it or increase it. So say you want the video to play with the audio and your voice, then you will adjust the music's level a little down. But if the music alone is playing, then you can select whatever volume you want. Another great thing about adding audios per slide in Canva is that, as I said earlier, you can select any part of the clip whichever you want as you can see this is a very long audio so you can simply drag the cursor along the audio and you will get to select whatever part you want like this and it will also add as many seconds as the video is now say you have done your project and you want to come back and edit some of the audios or you want to find out or you're creating a new project and you want to use the same audio then how will you find out just by going through the project well open the project and go to the timeline click on any audio and click elsewhere and you can see all these audios if you just hover your cursor on any of them you can see the name is getting displayed over here like you can see this is the name of this audio and then this is the name of this audio and then this again over here and one of the new features of the audio part in Canva is you can use BeatSync to sync the audio with your page, like with the audio. But yes, that is only for pro members. So if you want that feature as well, you can subscribe to Canva's plans. And then if you click on any audio, you get these three things in audio effects. As I said, you have fade in, fade out. Fade in would be really good to add in the initial audio, like the intro audio. And adjust, as I said, is you can just adjust to any part of the audio. You can take in any part of the audio to sync with your uh, video. And then you also have the volume button, as I said earlier. So if you want to access all those, you simply click on the audio and you will get it on the top navigation bar inside the editor. And so now if we play the video, you can see that everything is in sync and the audio is also playing with the video. So this is how you can add audio per slide in your video or presentation on Canva. With this, we have completed our tutorial. We truly hope it has helped you. Do let us know all your thoughts in the comment section below. We'll catch you soon in our next video. Till then, stay tuned and stay subscribed.